Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's See What Happens. I am the World's Address, and today we are playing Observer, and I'm going to start out uh, with a, I guess, a content warning. This is a horror game. It is, in fact, uh, from what I have read, been called a mix of cyberpunk, CSI, and uh, Silent Hill. So this is a cyberpunk horror game, which means it is more than likely going to be not safe for work, which means my commentary and comments are also not going to be safe for work. Horror games are not typically my thing. Ooh, that seems a little loud. Let's turn that down a bit. They're not typically my thing, but this is one of the games that I got from uh, Twitch Prime for free this month, so I wanted to play it. Just letting you guys know up front that uh, instead of being kind of cutesy and all of that, uh, this game will be lots of me swearing. So uh, let's get right down to it, I guess. New game. the left mouse button, I think. In Krakow. Is that me? Am I asleep in a car? Come in, Lazarski. Lazarski, you there? Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, sure. Yeah, I mean... You okay there? I've been hailing you for the past five minutes. I'm fine. I must have dozed off. No rest for the wicked. How's the dream eater treating you? Well, I'm not a vegetable yet. Could have fooled me. Hardy hard. I'm serious, Dan. Your signal's all over the place. Have you taken your meds? Uh, do I, oh, ah, okay, there it is. I was, I was trying to find the reticle, there, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Wow, that was convincing. Take your meds, detective. I need you clear-headed. Okay. Press the middle mouse button to check your status and use Synchronize. Oh, by the way, uh, the voice actor is Rutger Hauer, so that's why he sounds like Rutger Hauer, because it is. Also looks like Rutger Hauer. Okay. Uh, do I just push this button? Yes. <sighs> Is that why my vision was all messed up? Am I better now? Hey, look at that. Looking better already. Yeah. Wouldn't want me to mess up. Can you see the headlines? Another leech goes berserk. Don't be like that. It's just... Yeah. yeah. What's this about? Just checking in or you need me downtown? Nah, just a checkup. No one left for you to interrogate. That's a bummer. Sounds pretty bad. Yep, not pretty. The explosion leveled half a block. The place is still on fire. Corporate goons all over the place, securing the area. Covering your tracks, you mean? Hmm. Um. Careful what you say. This is a monitor channel. Who is this? How'd you get this frequency? Don't you recognize me? Adam? Yes. Well, what's left of me? Dad. What happened? Where, where have you been all this time? Oh. Away from you? Nope, don't like it. I thought it would be easier. Your voice after all these years. Uh-huh. Isn't. Come on, Adam, don't start. I really thought I could pull it off, you know? 
was so close. They're making a difference. Just setting us all free. But now it's... Can't be for nothing. Doesn't matter. Tell oh, hey. You are. There we go. Come and get you. Shit. Dad. For once in your life, just listen to me. Whatever happens, I need you to remember. You're not in control. Adam, can you hear me? You're still there? Adam. Adam, hear me. Dad? Dad? Hmm. Matriarch, display caller ID. Displaying now. Kravinsky. That's new. Matriarch, locate source of last call. Triangulating coordinates. Okay. Location established. Tenement building. Class C district. Oh, good. Jesus. Adam, the stacks. I just had to hit bottom. Huh? All right. Rock fucking bottom. Well, here we go. That's the apple. Ooh. Oh, yeah, that's... That's not okay. So, ooh, that's cool looking, though. So, from... Mmm, gross. Even grosser. From what I have read about this game, you are an observer. You delve into people's dreams and memories via that thing and uh, walk inside of them seeing what they've done uh, criminals I should say I think but since this is very cyberpunk you've got a lot of cyberpunk style drugs where you're, you're basically diving into strung out drug addled people's ooh that's fun uh dreams so there's going to be a lot of creepy and scary and and what have you so if you don't like that i'm going to be honest with you this is probably not going to be for you i'm also going to be a hundred percent honest i am a super wuss when it comes to scary games i love scary movies but something about being so much closer to the screen and having the sound piped directly into my ears via my headset makes a scary game that much worse for me. So I can't promise that I am going to stick with this game, but I can promise that I'm at least going to give it a try. Hold on. Let's see if we can, uh, uh, gameplay. Let's make this a little tiny bit more sensitive. And video. Is there a way to get rid of... No. There is not. And we're good on that too. Okay. I was hoping that there was going to be a way to get rid of the motion... The, the motion blur. That's too much. Do, do, do. Hey. Yeah. Need to get out. Easy there, Tin Man. I'm not looking for trouble. Oh, Tenant. Yes. Um, sort of. Name. Grabinski. Leon Grabinski. Then. Uh, uh, apartment 7. Uh, uh, ground floor. Through the courtyard. Turn right, turn left. Straight ahead, turn right. Yeah, I got it. 
Back with him forwards. Thanks. Mm. Door open. Right, left, straight, right. Okay. Oh, hold left mouth. Oh, cool. Uh, ooh. Attention citizens. Curfew is now in effect in all Class C districts. Remain in your apartments and enjoy your chosen holographic content. Thank you for your cooperation. Jacked Ink Tattoo Shop. What is that? Is that a statue? Oh, ah, oh, yeah, there it is. Okay, I can see it better now. Neat. Alright. The courtyard. Oh, he's got a nice corner. Alright. Left. Straight ahead. I hear a dog. Oh, I don't like that. Ah. Okay, so... Shit. Hmm. Ooh, that's a lot of blood. Please don't jump. Yeah, no shit. Yeah, that makes sense too. Calm down, calm down, calm down. It's okay. Dispatch, this is Nazarski, ID 656210. Can anyone hear me? Maybe it's not him. Doesn't have to be. Okay. Time to breathe. Very nice. This is Lazarski 656210 setting up a crime scene. Hmm. Oh, I've got electromagnet vision? I need to check the victim's compass for connection. The victim's compass. Hmm. Is it that? Yeah. Found a headless uh, corpse. Need to identify the, vic the victim. A distress call came through his communicator. Better check it out. Did I push the wrong? I pushed the wrong button, didn't I? Right mouse button. My bad. HN. Gotta start somewhere. Hmm. Consumer grade communication device. Illegal modification detected. Heavy encryption. Q for vi biovision. Oof. Fail. Time of death. About an hour ago. Before you call me. Hmm. Blood type. Error. It's interesting. 
Looks like he got clawed up pretty hard. So I guess observers are detectives as well. Like, they've got legitimate detective... No match found. Contaminants detected. Failed to extract forensic data. Hello. What the fuck do we have in here? Yeah, for real. Yeah, right? Huh. Interesting. That looks like it. Hello. Check out what you are, though. This man was busted. Signal must have come from somewhere else. Okay. A lot of different security panels. Yeah, there it is. You can see the damage that was done. Also, let's take a look at this. Stun baton. Um. Q, Biovision. Mm. Nothing. E. Six million volts. Wasn't enough. Damn. All right. Six million volts is uh. It's a considerable amount of voltage. The hard drives. What the hell is all this? Okay. Collateral damage or evidence disposal? Cloud station server. Hmm. Structural damage detected. Well, that would make sense. How about you? You're still part of that. Okay, you're part of that. Stun baton. Hello, what's this? Processors. a bunch of processors. That's like an acetylene tank. That's a painting. Um, Q, right? Bio... Nope. Alright. I've got a motherboard. What's this? Nothing that's showing up. Super afraid that like something's gonna jump out at me. You know, like it does. All right. Well, nothing else in here. A lot of damaged nonsense. It looks to me like that's about as good as I'm gonna get in this portion of the room. Pretty much looked at everything. Damn. He is straight up missing that head. Alright. Oh. Oh, good. I didn't find it. Yay. Actually, we should have this open.
All right, anything? Oh, it's P. I bet that's P. Oh. Better known as Fee. You've never touched this, but illegal psychoactive substance. Interesting. That's cool. He's got like the ability to check it all out, huh? Feel like there's something in there. I also super feel like something's gonna jump out at me. And it's putting me on edge. Hmm. Nothing. Hello. Adam Lazarski, but they're data storage. Yeah. The encryption is too complex for my hacking tool. I'm taking it with me. I might be able to decode it later. Huh. Cool. Alright, well, I've got that. Let's open up all of this stuff. This is one of the reasons why I like the cyberpunk, it's just Everything is integrated so well. There's something in there. Ha! Uh, so this is your apartment. Doesn't mean. Is that supposed to be him? Interesting. Okay. Oh, I think that's everything. Wait, what's that? Bingo. Got it. Ooh. Uh. Code. Middle mouse button is hack. Connection established. Damn. Four. So what happens if I hack it again? Nothing? Shit. All right. Hey, there's a thing I missed. What are you? The victim is equipped with an ID mixer. Identification not possible. Damn it. Damn. Let's open up these drawers. Maybe I'll find a number, like, scrawled somewhere. Nope. Nope. And... More nope. Damn. Am I missing...
crap. Something, something, something four. But I don't know what the first three numbers are. Wait, 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 wait. Please don't be... It's worth a shot. Damn. Oh, good, a bathroom. Great. You. What's this? Powerful augmentation stabilizer. Strict dosage control advised. 500 milligrams of synchrozine. Oh! Oh, that's for me! Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Anything in here? Nope. Alright. Though it ignored something. There. Why? I mean, like, bingo and all, but what the hell's the number? Also, what made it through these bars? Yeah, let's, let's see what I'm still missing. The lockdown triggered the apartment's auxiliary security system. My forensic vision might help me find a way to deactivate it. Well, yeah, but I don't have the code. So, I mean, yeah, it does, but... I can't get out. Ha-ha! Security console. Illegal modification detected. Unregistered. Damn. Unregistered security code. Guess I triggered the security system. Must be a way to deactivate it. Well, yeah. Like. Any of this useful? I mean, I know where to go. And I know roundabouts what to do. Picking random numbers now. Damn. Alright, okay. I don't want to get stuck in this first. I don't want to get stuck in this first place. You clever bastard. Printed on real paper. An archaic for you, Adam. <sighs> Anything in the EM? Anything in the bio? Nope, but that's the number. Oh, I do have a run, just not a jump. Where are you at? Damn. OK. 
Okay. Dude. in the system. Brief history of the nanophage. It looks like an Atari. Like, it looks like an old... Somebody put a keyboard on an old Atari. Let's see what we're looking at here. What do you have for your mail? They know. Listen, I know you're a busy man and all, but we gotta talk now. I think they're on to me. For real this time. I'm almost certain someone followed me home yesterday, and I just saw this weird guy outside my window. Just standing there. If you can't guarantee my safety, then I'm out. I got enough problems as it is. Hmm. As far as our little mule goes, don't worry. I can manage her. She's not like us. She knows she's in over her head, and it clearly terrifies her. You can't expect too much from a simple mind. For now, just focus on your work and leave the human relations aspect of our project to me. For the time being, calm down and maintain your focus. Eyes on the prize. P.S. Glad you liked the piece. I think it captures the essence of what we're trying to accomplish. How's that? That? Is that the piece? <sighs> corrupted. Corrupted. All corrupt. Home security. I've deactivated the apartment security system, leaving the crime scene. Indeed. Hmm. Thank you. Anything else on this table? The wind up, uh, the wind up soul. Oh, Sigmund Freud, uh, psychoanalytic theory. Future of robotics. Forensic genetics, the DNA blueprint. Mechanical engineering. Smart guy. All right, well, let's get out of here. This just doesn't feel right. You're still alive. No way. The hell is all that? Yo! Whoa! Could we not, though? Because this is real scary. Did they do something in here? Nope. Okay. I thought maybe they, like, took the apartment building or something. I don't know. I need to talk to you. You broke it! No, you broke it! 
Go with police business. He is dead. It is a murder. Police business. Just answer the question, and I'll get out of your face. So that's how it's gonna be, huh? Why don't you knock on that door and see for yourself? Can you describe him or not? I don't have time for games. All right, all right. Younger fellow, probably in his twenties. Well, anything else? Nah, I never really got a good look at him. Medium height, medium build. He was just kind of there, you know? Hmm. Have you seen anything suspicious around the building? Any strangers stalking around? Nah, I don't pay much attention to the other tenants. Bunch of losers. A lot of them. You're so dumb. Not as dumb as you are. Nuh-uh. You're way dumber. Shut the fuck up! Not upstanding citizens like you. You bet your ass. Good thing we'll be getting out of this dump soon. <laughs> Is that right? Father of the year. Yep, I've been working my way up. I even filed for a status upgrade. Once that goes through, we'll be moving to a B-class district in no time. Yeah, good luck with that. The nice guy. So does this show that they're their home? Okay, well. Hi, this is Tom. And Irene. <laughs> we hope you're having a positively peachy day. Oh, we sure do. Sadly, we're not in right now. Huh. <laughs> but you can leave your message after the beep, and we'll get back to you as soon as we're home. Yay! Oh, I mean, beep. <laughs> they are far too chipper for where they live. That is a lot of dead birds, by the way, just in case. Also, their door is made out of a safe door. That's been, like, bolted to something. Here, let you. Number eight. Got a minute, sir. KPD. Oh, God, they're here. The cleaners are here. Huh. Well, he he was probably not doing illegal things. Damn. Let's get out of here. You. What is it? What's up with the lockdown? Is it the page? Is there an outbreak? Too early to tell. I'm looking into it right now. Looking into it? Are you out of your mind? We might all be infected. You don't know that. Best thing we can do is stay calm and... And let them come and slaughter us? I won't let them take me. I won't. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. What's through here? Gross. Super gross is what's through there. Hmm. I guess we have to talk to everybody. Nothing. Locked. Sorry. Um. All right. Well, let's go through all the doors. KPD, I need to ask you some questions. 
Do you know what's going on? My holler projection got cut off. I, I can't get a signal. The building is under lockdown. No external connection. Not much we can do. Shit. Sounds serious. So, uh, you wanted to ask me something? Do you know who lives in apartment seven? Seven? I didn't even know anyone lived there. Hmm. Uh, hey, you wouldn't happen to know when they're gonna fix the connection. Not that it's like super important to me or anything. I just need to know. Huh. Let's see. Hmm, might take some time. I'm not sure if anyone even knows we've been locked in. It might take a while. Oh God. I mean, sure, that's fine. It's just, you know, the apartment feels very small all of a sudden. Kind of claustrophobic. Is it hot in here? I'm sweating something awful. Just take a deep breath. It's gonna be fine. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? I'm just gonna sit here and wait for them to fix it. Can you talk to me some more? It makes it kind of easier. Hmm. You've been living here long? Oh, well, I, uh, uh, it must have been at least seven or eight years. Ever had the lockdown before? Um, I don't think so. I don't remember my projector going off. Ever. Weird. Well, what do you want to talk about? Um, uh, yeah, you know. Uh, Gorski the Giant was fighting Killer Cromer today. You an AMA fan? Uh, not really. Sounds like you are. Of course I don't know who won since my projector went out. <sighs> Why are my hands shaking? Sorry, I don't have time for this. Oh, okay. Uh, I understand. It's no problem. I'll just sit here, alone. God, I'm really starting to sweat like a pig. <laughs> So that pigeon, that pigeon on the ground, I was watching that thing, and it they look like a mix between a pigeon and a vulture. They're like a pigeon-sized vulture. Alright. Busted urinal. Hmm. Repo man. I'll keep that. Could be useful. I don't know. Uh, let's see. We're here. Let's see if we can... I don't know. Let's see if we can talk to some more people. Hi. Nope. KBD, I need to talk to you. Get away from me, man. I got a piece on me, and I ain't afraid to use it. No, you don't. Now calm down. I'm just looking for some answers. Oh, I know <laughs> how you get your answers. I got nothing to tell you. Well, you're nice. Hmm. Interesting. Will this tell me who it belongs to? Nope. Dang. Hmm. Alright. Well, that's the toilet. Some lockers. <sighs> the creepy people. Eight. Nine was not helpful. Nobody's home there. Nobody's home there. Uh, that one's got a red. Nobody's home and it's locked. Anything good in here? Hmm. 
now. Oh, wait. Uh, yeah, through here. Right? Shoot, no. I got myself turned around. Crap. It's hard when this stuff kind of looks the same. And you. Time to hack it. Let's see if maybe there's something we can do. Zero. Four. Four. Six. Oh, thank you. Interesting. What's that? Yo, what is that? Whoa! Shit. It moved. Nobody's home. Nobody's home. Well, or just nobody is answering. Could we also try any sort of... Nope. All right, weird. Hello, pigeon. Nobody's home. Ah, someone's home. Oh. Come to the door, please. Just want to talk. Who are you? Did Chiron send you? I'm with the KPD, if that's what you're asking. Seriously? We haven't had a cop around these parts in... Never, I guess. <laughs> That one now. Yeah, good luck. You're gonna fucking need it. Hmm. Oh, uh, <clears throat> the state of the art holographic display offers virtual reality grade immersion. The mighty processor will handle even the most complex calculations. The kinetic interface allows for maximum comfort and efficiency. Now, Erratic wave frequency. Hang on. There. Version 1.2. We'll go in that door in just a second. I have a feeling that that's how we get out of here. He's got a better, uh, a better setup than I do for audio. Oh, uh, starting to unsynchronize. Hang on a second. Thank you. We're starting to get out of line here. Let's, uh... That's better. We're mostly... We're mostly doing okay. Oh. Thank you. What do we have in here that's useful? Anything? That. That's about it. Okay. Anything blood-wise? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Check out this computer. 
the wall stands tall. Our brave boys and girls continue to defend from the eastern hordes. Uh, Mr. Jurkowski, while we all greatly appreciate your exemplary service and the sacrifices you have made for your country, the VRI policy enforces a strictly proactive stance on helping our brave veterans reintegrate with society. Regular coverage requires a deed of permanent B-class employment, presented to our representative on an annual basis. Your current janitorial position simply does not qualify. Given these circumstances, we must sadly deny your claim and are therefore forced to terminate your participation in the program effective immediately. Damn. As of today, the veteran, the veteran pres, uh, pension fund will no longer cover periodic maintenance of your cybernetic prosthetics. <clears throat> we wish you the best. Shit. Alright, this has gone on long enough. Veteran or not, I don't give a crap anymore. One more message and I'll find you and beat the fucking junk out of you. My mother can no longer take this shit. She's sick of telling you over and over that her husband, my father, died 18 years ago. She's moved on. We all have. No one wants to live in the past to constantly relive a tragedy. So for the last time, Mike Jaroski is dead. He's been dead for a long time. Have someone type that into your busted ass head of yours. I don't care how you do it. Just fucking remember this time. Even if it's a toss-up between this and remembering when to take a dump. Because the next message you send her will earn you a broken fucking jaw. Consider this your final warning. Interesting. Ground floor. Leon Gerbinski. Of course. Two agents. Aha! Helena Nova, the purple one, four. And Helen Nader. Cool. Same floor. Cool. Outsourced. All right. Well, we'll obviously check that out. Oh. Ah. Uh. So, how does this work? Oh, there I am. <laughs> Look at that. This is the best. Woohoo! I made it! That was great. That was fun. Alright. With fire and sword. That's cool. Alright. Do not tell me I locked myself in. Fuck. Jesus Christ! Not a good idea to sneak up on me, you know. Need to get out. Jesus Christ. Scared the shit out of me. Police business. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I know what you are. Oh, yeah? Back. During the war. To Kua and I. Sent for one. No few. To get into his head. I'm not a threat. If you're worried I'm gonna snap, don't be. They don't even let us carry guns anymore. Not worried. Past glory. Past most things. You fought in the big one. Is that why you got all this junk in you? Plasma sweep. Mm. Hit our convoy. Mm. Borrowed. Through armor. Sorry, I didn't that sounds rough. Yes. Uh. Something triggered the lockdown. Mm. Trying to get it open. Rudy and I. 
Rudy. You think it might be the nanophage? You had any recent outbreaks? No. Last one. Long time ago. Now in my grave. All the big ones. Bad. The implants. Who's Rudy? I take it Rudy is the robot. Multifunction service and maintenance. Your own. Don't lose it. What? Mm. Want yourself. Sometimes. Mm. Need to track manually. Huh. Can we lift the lockdown from the inside somehow? Or get a message out? No. Keep people in. Isolate, accommodate, alleviate. That's not creepy at all. Yeah, we all know how that last one used to work. I mean, hell, he might know something about Adam. What could you tell me about the tenant in apartment seven? Tenant? Yeah, tenant. How long has he been living there? Yeah. Maybe longer. Not good with time. You ever talked to him? Didn't get out much. None of them do. All right, Tin Man. Let me know if it comes back to you. All right. I'm heading out. Can you give me full access to the building? Uh -huh. no assistance. Unstable. Yeah. Unlocked. What I could. Thanks. You better stay here. There might be some very nasty people out there. Nasty. Uh, huh. Bad. Look, yeah. Just stay safe. And you know what? I never got your name. I'm Dan. Huh? Name? Did you unlock this door and aren't going to sneak up on me again? You creepy bastard. You scared the shit out of me. Alright. Yeah, there's that with Fire and Sword Spiders game. Remove your implants. Okay. Fuck. Oh, shit. Human body, male. Damn, no life functions. How do I get in? It doesn't give me a, uh... Like, it doesn't give me a thing to open that door with. shit. You know what? That's as good enough a place to end this as any. Uh, we found a dead body in this next room. This apartment complex is just full of dead bodies. Uh, by the way that it's still swinging, I would guess that it just happened. your 
implant. Oh, he's knocked the door. Okay. They've knocked the door. Or the, the, not the door. They've, uh, dropped something in front of the doors. So now that nobody can get in. All right, well, that is going to do it for this episode, guys. Uh, it's a creepy game. It's kind of weird. I played about an hour of it now. Might do another. We'll see how it goes. Let's get out of there. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so far, not so bad. A uh, couple of jump scares. Not a big fan of jump scares. That one with the uh, the janitor guy definitely scared the shit out of me. But, uh, yeah. Let me know what you think about this one. Um, I know that it is completely... Whoops. Uh, it's completely out of character for the channel. But I kind of want to play as many of these Prime Month games as I can from Twitch Prime. So, yeah. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you like what I'm doing. I really appreciate you guys taking time out of your busy day to drop in and see what I'm up to. Um, this game's kind of weird. I'm really hoping to play a little bit more of it. Maybe like two or three more episodes just to kind of get a feel for it. But uh, I don't know. If the story picks up, if the action picks up, I'm definitely going to get deeper into it. As he said before, I don't have a gun, so it's less of a first-person shooter and more of a first-person... Kind of like Outlast how uh, Outlast you have a camera and no weapon but it's still very like psychological horror and stuff like that so that looks like what this might be I don't know anyway you guys are the best I mean that from the bottom of my heart uh, thank you so much and as always I'll see you guys next time bye